So you took in civilians too? Yes, we took in civilians uh, if they were injured as a result of the war. Of course, there are about a, a million, a million and a half people around Kandahar alone, so we couldn't take all the injuries that they had. Uh, sometimes if we could, we'd help out the civilian hospital by taking in a car accident victim or something like that, because um, uh, the roads are very primitive over there and the drivers are, uh, they're spooky. Um, and so they pile in a whole bunch of people in a car and then even in the trunk of the car, so, um, and they drive very, very fast, so we'd get accidents too. but only if we had the, the, the resources available. Um, but uh, just from the war, we'd get children, many, 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 many children. Uh, uh, disproportionate amount of children would, uh, would come in. And that's hard on the people, that's hard. Uh, I have uh, uh, a lot of my staff were parents themselves of uh, young children at home, so it gets to you after a while. Uh, of course, we try to keep up the morale. Uh, uh, we'd uh, make the boy, you know, we'd entertain the boys and the girls as they were uh, getting better, because we had to keep them for a longer period. It was very difficult for the uh, the staff, and uh, because of children, I guess it it hits anybody. Um, I was interviewed uh, on Australian TV one night when we'd had children all day, and we'd lost two of them, uh, two of the injured little guys. Uh, uh, we couldn't save. And uh, I almost broke down in front of the camera when she asked me, Major Dauphin, what does it do to you as a man to see all these children? And I just, uh, I thought she was going to ask me a standard question, you know. Uh, so, yeah, that was, it was tough. It was tough on everybody, the children. And bad injuries, you know. Can you tell me what they were like? Well, um, um, one child, would, i give you an example, one child came in with a, a gangrenous arm, that, so his arm had been uh, ripped off and they had tried to reattach it at the civilian hospital and it was all black, so we had to lop it off. Um, another child, did, did he, but he survived, survived it very well. Uh, children are very resilient, especially Afghan children who are not complainers, they, uh, if they, uh, you'll have to hurt them a lot so, before they complain. The child's father made an offer to you. Yes, he asked me uh, uh, if, we, uh, if uh, we were going to take his son's arm off, uh, he would gladly give one of his arms to replace uh, uh, the son's arm. So I, I told him, I'm, we're not that good, sir. Uh, uh, let's just try and save your boy.